Hey you guys, it's Brittany and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a November recap um, of all of my planner spreads for the month of November in my Erin Condren Life Planner. So this is my monthly view and I'm seriously so obsessed with it. Um, after decorating my monthly view for a couple of months now, I'm really into decorating it and I'm really loving it. So basically, my monthly view, if this is your first time watching my video, just pretty much lays out the main things that are happening for the month of November. Um, for instance, anniversaries, birthdays, paydays, bill dues, um, major holidays, so Thanksgiving, um, doctor's appointments, um, things like that. And then on the side, I like to track my Scentsy business. So what I sold for the month and um, my numbers for my, my Scentsy team. And then I also like to track my credit score for the month. Um, I do have it covered just for like personal reasons for my um, credit score here. But yeah, so that's pretty much what I do for my monthly view, but I really love the way it comes out and it definitely adds more when like I decorate it. I don't know, I just really love it. I love the coffees on top. Um, I don't know, I, I really, I think it's my favorite monthly spread so far. So anyways, enough about that. Let's get into the actual weekly spreads. So for their first week in November, it starts from October 31st to November 6th. I did do a Halloween theme since Halloween is, you know, did start on that Monday. Um, so I was like, you know what, I'm going to do one more Halloween spread. And I really like the way that it came out. This was a free printable from Planning Problem 101. I will have her link down below if you watch a lot of my planner videos already. Um, the recaps, then you would have seen a lot of her links already and you might be familiar with her. But if not... Most of my planter um, like spreads come from her website. I love them so, so much. Um, it's not everything is from her though. Like the turkey countdown here for Thanksgiving, I, um, I made. The checklist and the heart checklist are mine. Um, I Not that I don't like hers, but I prefer mine better. So I use mine, the habit tracker is mine. And like these little like icons here and like this, um, upload is mine but for the most part everything is hers like the full boxes the headers or the date covers excuse me the um the glitter headers things like that half boxes are hers um so anyways yeah i really like it i'm trying to think what majorly happened this week this was actually a pretty busy week for us um we took a laundry trick or treating for the first time which was really exciting my apartment had like a little like raffle and we won twice and then we had like a little festival for Alondra at her gymnastics which was fun and then yeah we celebrated our year in three months on that Saturday um, of being married but yeah so it's pretty much just like a busy week but nothing like really like bam that was like out of this world I was a slacker and I didn't do my habit tracker for that week but oh well but yeah so pretty much that is what this spread looks like and I actually really love this spread so then moving on to November 7th to November 13th, I did a more fall theme. This is a free printable from Three Cheers Co. I will have them linked down below. I've used them several times as well, and I really like their stuff. Um, so I really love the way that this came out. It's definitely fall and woodsy, and it matched like the, the November colors like perfectly. Um, but pretty much the major thing here is, boom, voted election day. Um, so I hope you all did, you know, exercise your right to vote. Um, but I mean, and then the other huge thing that week was Edom's birthday. My honey boo turned 26. That's my husband in case you're new to my channel, you don't watch our vlogs. That's my husband. And we celebrated his birthday. But yeah, I mean, pretty much a just basic week really. But I really love the way it's like really filled out. Um, so yeah, I like that. I love these boxes when they're like whited out so then you can actually write something in them and you don't have to necessarily use half boxes. But yeah, that's pretty much, oh, we had our first Honda payment. If you didn't know, we got a new Honda CRV. So our first payment came through on that Sunday. Um, so that was fun. Not really. But anyways, yeah, that's what this week looks like. And then moving on to the week of November 14th to November 20th. This is from the Planning Problem 101 again. Um, kind of like a blank spread. I feel like you can tell the difference between this week and last week where this is more filled out. But I didn't have hardly anything going on, you guys. Like, seriously, nothing. It was such a boring week. I mean, the only exciting thing that happened was we got our first snowfall. So I'm in Minnesota. So our first snowfall was on Friday, November 18th. That was the most most exciting thing, you guys. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, pretty much a blank week. A lot of blank, empty spaces. But didn't have a lot going on. So, sometimes that's nice, though, as well. But in the planner world, it's not nice because then it looks boring. <laughs> but I love the glitter, though. I feel like I've been doing glitter spreads, like, every month. At least, like, full glitter spreads. And I really love the way that it comes out. 
Moving on to the last week of November, which is November 21st to the 27th. This is Thanksgiving week. And um, yeah, from Planning Problem 101, again, that website there. I use different paper on this one. This is removable matte paper, so it's a little bit different. Um, I don't know how it's going to come out on camera. But it's just your typical Thanksgiving um, week. I mean, it has a bunch of little food deco, which I really like. Um, this week, honestly, I only worked three days, so not a lot happened. Um... We didn't even go to, we have gymnastics and swim lessons for my daughter every single Saturday, but we actually didn't, um, the gymnastics was closed that day, and then we decided to squ skip swim lessons. My daughter was a little bit sick, so we are like, you know what, let's just skip it. So I still wanted to mark it though, because I know, I don't know, just for a reminder. But I mean, we pretty much celebrated Thanksgiving. I wrote it what I was thankful for. We went Black Friday shopping. I put up the Christmas tree on Sunday. So this week is definitely a little bit more busy, but I mean... This week, I didn't really do anything. But, I mean, yeah, that's pretty much it for Thanksgiving week. It's kind of, you know, wasn't too crazy or busy. And it was nice to only work three days. And I can't believe, you guys, we're like less than a month away from Christmas. I'm starting to stress out. Um... I need to go Christmas shopping. So that is it for my planner recap. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Um, if definitely comment down below. Let me know what your favorite spread was for the month of November. I'm gonna say mine was definitely this spread here. I just love it so much. Whenever I look at it, I just have to like stop and stare at it. So this one is definitely my favorite. So comment down below. Let me know what your favorite is. If you did enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.